¡Vamos! ¡Vamos! Oh, they're there, ok, they are already there. All right, man. Man, my, my, my boy, I cannot go to upstairs, man. My, my son just saw me and he told me, he's, he's addicted to the Nintendo Switch. And he just told me, papi, play with me. When, when he see me going there, play with me, man. I cannot go, man. He don't let me cast, amigo. Dude, I, 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 I feel you, man. I feel you. He is the, you know, he wants to spend some time with you playing a Nintendo. A lot. Yeah, yeah. I know. It, it's, it's lovely, yeah. right? But sometimes you're like, ah, I have something else to do right now. <laughs> Yeah, well, the problem is that the, the job that I have is uh, being at home completely. And now you know that he got uh, uh, he got a small ac well, a small yeah, accident. accident. He got an accident yeah. all the day, and he's at home. He cannot go to the school to the school. So poor him. He's he's bored. He's super active and has to be all the time in the sofa. But anyway, let's go to the game. And doubt asking yeah. in this map, no boring. <laughs> what is this doubt? I'm prepared. <laughs> doubt. <laughs> you know, map. I even saw on his stream he was <laughs> launching single player menu. Uh, to load out Chaos Pit because he didn't know how the map looks like. <laughs> but, but, Jordan, look at the Lambrick and Doubt is doing for the first Lambrick. I mean, Chaos Pit, man. I want to cry. What? what he doesn't he want doing? to go outside? Well, what is he doing? Well, one thing, he has poles. Yep. Smart boy, he doesn't need to cut to take goal. Could oh. one there. He doesn't need to cut to take goal, so the Lord oh. with the masterpiece here. So he's Man. just gonna go standard and go with the stone and try to play normal. He has gold, he has a stone, mining a stone. One thing that I don't like is both a stone in the same spot. He might have doubt notice and he arrests that area. Then no stone and no goal for doubt. Yeah, so. but that that's that's in insane. And man, kudos to you that you figured that one out because. Uh, someone in my chat earlier, when Chaos Pit was mentioned, he was saying, yeah, yeah, Pulse is the best Sif there. And I was like, what's so special about Pulse? Like, what's wrong with Pulse? Like, why, why are they so good? But now it also makes sense, right? Yeah. Because with the stone, you get gold as well. Whoa, that's so smart. That is so smart. I was so expecting smart. also that, I was expecting also that Byzantines could be very good here. Too. Yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah. Yeah. Very, very Crazy. good for the trans army. Towers also more HP and uh, well, yeah. the transition in this kind of map. Yeah. But honestly, he didn't know how it looks the map, but he picked poles. Doubt was <laughs> debating, man. I mean, he know how it looks this map. This map has been a while, uh, around forever, you know? Yeah. And uh, yeah. well, let's yeah. see. It's, it's like, the, like the name say, it's chaotic. Yeah. But uh, we were so wrong. I was about to, to ask you about the prediction, but we were talking about, well, mirror benefit to who player, what player, uh, Tato, then doubt one. <laughs> <laughs> that man, we shouldn't do any predictions anymore. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, let's just go cast what we see, you know? Yeah. <laughs> no oh. prediction, man. Uh, Tato, we fail. Tato pushing the deer, man. Tato pushing the deer. <laughs> no, but... Yeah, well, man. Sicilians. Man, mm. what do you think? Interesting. What What is the better stuff here? Now I, it's my time to uh, raise the hard questions. Um, <laughs> I mean, for me, uh, what I like from Pauls is that with the stone and gold, yeah. uh, with the stone you get gold. Other than that, I don't like anything else from Pauls <laughs> in this matchup. The, I mean, how, do, how do you no? always say complete... Uh, complete? Well, what is the saying you always say, man? Complete... Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Domination? Domination, man. <laughs> Domination for Sicilians in in any other in any other part of the game here. Like yeah. Yeah. in my opinion, Sicilians is a better Sith. Yeah, let, let's see. I mean, uh, Doubt has something prepared. He's going for Barrack now. And gathering stone as well. So he's definitely aware that there's stone on this map. And yeah, that, I wonder what is he going to do? He's going for Loom now. Means he will Go Fuel Age after, and the Barrack is also indicating that he wants to apply aggression early on. However, I love, I also love what Tato is doing right now. He's just fully walling himself, playing super defensive, and he just wants to go for fast castle, I suppose. No, he's doing long. Okay, never mind. So he's going for Fuel Age, but I don't think he, we will see a lot of um, army from him in Fuel Age. He will play passive and uh, build... How's it called? Dungeons, if it's needed. Yeah, well, I think he will need it. And I think he will do a dungeon exactly in the part of the stone. Otherwise, he's going to have no stone at all because all the stone yep. are forward and in the same area. Yep. And then if you are wall and with the dungeon there, 
there's not a single problem. It's true yeah. that Paul's got the, the crazy farmers if you put in the forework, but Sicilians, you make horse corner and you get double the food. So I yeah. prefer Sicilians. The longer the game goes, the better for Sicilians. I mean, here, yeah, he, you, you can see he's getting gold already, four villages, and he's going forward yeah. with yeah. three militias, and obviously he can make men at arms. Okay, that's something that you cannot really do with uh, with Sicilian because there's no goal, so it's very dangerous. And Tatot, in my opinion, need to wall and make a dungeon there. Yep. I don't like that mill forward now for Tato because he's completely exposed. Yeah, yeah. I don't like that one as well. I'm not sure where Tato is even uh, wasting his time in uh, getting a mill there. And I honestly like the position of Doubt right now. He will place the tower, he will get men at arms. And don't forget, Tato, he has all the stone on the left hand side. He can play uh, place one dungeon and that's it. And they also cost so much, right? So, uh, I feel like strategy-wise, Tato is in a worse position here. And he plays... Look! Look at where he's placing the dungeon map! Look at that! Aye, aye, aye. Well, he's doing this because he's going to make a dungeon there. And he's going for the completely defensive approach. And boomy! One, he's walling on the left. I don't know if this is open. No, he's wall completely on the left. That dojo yep. is going to help completely yep. uh, to, to avoid any more aggression. But with another tower, he's going to take the berries. But this is the thing. Tatot is already with a good micro. In oh, it's open. It's open. It's open. It's open. There's a hole. There's a hole. You need to wall. Uh, if he's not uh, walling, it's going to be a disaster. Uh, aye, aye. Oh, it's stonewall. No, no, no. It's still open, I think. Oh, it's still God. open. Well, it's game. This is a game it, over. Th this is game. It should this be game, game for over. doubt. Two villages down. No? Yeah. Uh, oh, man. Well, I wouldn't expect this kind of fail in this game from, from Tatot. Uh, because usually in this in this kind of map, but he's going to try to rewall, of course. But how do you defend against four men at arms now? With uh, nothing. He got yeah. only villages, man. Yeah. And he's losing the third villager. This is a disaster. And the thing is, he can also place a tower on the wood line. Right? Yeah, right now, yes. Right yes. now, for sure. Yeah. Well, it's about to cut. He's doing the tower, but he need to cut that tree. That tree is 20 wood left. <laughs> He's going to be in time. He will He will put villas outside. Yeah. That's okay. Yeah. But he has no more wood now, Tato. Yeah. He's just taking all the stragglers. Oh, but he has his scouts. Well, one scout only. <laughs> yeah. Scouts. I was talking in plural, you know? <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> I mean, one scout. Okay. Man, 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 doubt not walling his towers. That's such a classic thing. <laughs> He's losing the tower on the left hand side. That is so annoying. That's really unnecessary, right? But this is perfect for doubt because he has just so much stone gathering gold as well. In the meanwhile, as we already analyzed uh, earlier, and he's building a tower on the left hand side on the berries of Tato. That's a very nice, uh, nice move as well. And man, look, look at doubt losing all his towers because of not, uh, him not walling those. Look, look at that. Just look at that. And honestly, yeah, he he was trying to go to the other one. Tato has a lumber camp at the back. He's still not taking gold. Yep. Okay. Yep. He didn't find one on the left that he has. He didn't explore at all. Yep. Well, Tato lost those two villages, but didn't super panic. The problem is that, obviously, he doesn't have any map control. He's not taking gold yet and doesn't really have army. Another yep. lumber camp on the left. Look how he's moving all over the map. I like that. Yep. And, well, now, what is Tao doing? Why he let this... He's going away with the men at arms, and now he's going to take the tower down, I believe. Why is he not oh, running is he, is, this tower? This no, is... no, he's ignoring. He's ignoring. <laughs> he was going to the, his own walls, and he was going to attack it still. And now Tatot can take this tower. Oh, no. It's going to take the tower for sure. What? Wall the, wall the villagers. Okay. Uh, wall it out. Wall it. What is that doing? What is that doing? <laughs> Well, he's gonna wall out himself. He's gonna lose a villager. Lost a villager here. I don't know. What's Make a gate. Here, Make but... a gate. Make a gate. Oh, that, that. Yes. Oh. Now an archery range. Okay. Well, it, it worked well. Honestly, I thought Tato was going to go directly outside. This yeah. this tower wasn't a big problem because he still have another. He d didn't need to take that tower yeah. down. He just needed to go, go in with the with the villagers. And he's still okay. He's still three villages behind. No <laughs> army at all for Tato. He has, he has a very good farming, if you ask me. Yeah. While only 
four pharmacists for, for doubt. He has Doesn't have the greatest economy. Yeah, he has pulse. Yeah, well, but... Uh, uh, the, I, but I he's feel... instant that food. The, this is... You know, I feel like Doubt's position is so good, but Tato crisis management has been extremely good as well. Right? This yeah, is... the problem is that yeah. with this situation he did here, uh, Tato let Doubt get into, into the outside when he wasn't even trying to get there. <laughs> you know? <Yeah>. So, <laughs> well... Yeah. This is... I mean, he will get that stone uh, wall down, yes, but what's the follow-up? I mean, he will run into more stone walls, right? So that's... I don't think that can be the play for Doubt here. I think he needs to make something work in the middle. And the problem with the way he's playing is that he is kind of giving up the middle position right now. And, man, how often have I mentioned? Why is Doubt not walling himself the towers? Like, why? I don't know. It's not a wall, and now he's gonna fight with so many villains. He's taking the spear. He has to be careful because he's doing more mana tarps. Now doing more scouts. Villa is gonna be down. I don't know. He can still attack that tower, but this is a mess. It's a mess. It's a necessary mess for doubt when he is with such a important <laughs> advantage because now he's gonna lose Villa's uh, both. Well, doubt yeah, is still is killing yeah. some villains, but he's gonna lose villains as well. Ooh, the mana tarps will help. There's a scout. The scouts don't really die against those spears because of uh, Sicilian's bonus. Yeah. I mean, they die, but not the same. But now the mana tarps will help a lot. Still, at the end, it's. He's taking the game, man. Like, yeah, this was, he's killing so many villains to Tato. This was very I, good. This I, was very good for Doubt, and he currently is uh, sitting comfortably, having a 45 uh, villager advantage here. The army on the left hand side will knock on the stone walls again, so they're not really proceeding further efficiently. And uh, yeah, I don't know. Like, Doubt is setting himself up very, very nicely. He still only has six on food, but still with poles, you can make a lot of things work with those uh, fast fall works, right? On the left hand side. Yeah, but, still, uh, yeah, go ahead. But, but I, I'm not sure about... I mean, he could have a much better advantage that he has already. Yep. He has... Well, he has four, four spears, five mana times. He has a lot of feudal army, but you see how now... Tato is doing a scout with 40 and now mining a lot of stone. If you start to make dungeons, you, you can snowball a little bit. Look at yep. these random towers. Look at the random tower now Doubt is doing there. Why, why is he doing that tower there? On the right hand side? I, <laughs> I don't know. The, the, the tower? In the is, south. In the south? Okay. Oh, this yeah, one. Okay. The, I, I think... Uh, the one uh, at the back from yeah. Doubt Base. I think he plays that one to avoid Tato to build farms in that area, but... I don't think it's necessary because you have a tower there anyway, right? So, yeah. Oh, look at, Look at this count now. Look at this count. Scouts, yeah. They will be able... Hilbert and Aaron Forge. Look at yeah. how many villages he's gonna lose now down because he's not reacting. My goodness. Already two villages down and he's still not reacting. He's still not reacting. He's still not reacting. Jordan! He you got him on the phone! Man. Okay, uh, now he's he is, now. but he lost already four villages already with this attack. Check the village number now. Oh, 41 to 43. Tato has yeah. uh, kind of equalized the position here. Very nice. Left hand side, tower coming up, dungeon coming up as well. And you see, Doubt is in a much worse position than he should have been just because of the fact that he not uh, he did not wall the left hand side. That was a huge mistake by him. And now Tato will be able to clean up the tower. 41 villages, villages against 45. Economy difference is uh, small, so they're both having kind of the same economy here. And let's see, I mean, the man at arms and here can do something against the dungeon, but yeah, it's too risky to jump into that. Uh, you can make you can put 10 villages in, you can put 10 villages in. Yeah, I don't need to put the villages in, he need to put and wall a little bit the dungeon as well. Aye, 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 why he didn't wall a little because now it's so many men at arms, but with some micro there. Mm, I don't know. A market will be definitely a must here by by Tatot. He has 800 wood, <laughs> 800 wood, and 400 food. And now a scout and villagers are ooh gonna lose another. Villagers yeah. yeah, on inside. Well, where's the market, man? <laughs> this this is a mess, man. man I, what I is love this. I love Tatot's micro. <laughs> it actually was good, but I I think he doesn't enjoy those kind of engagements here. Yeah. No, okay, no, no, clean, no. He cleaning does up. It. Well, he's losing them all. <laughs> he's losing all, man. <laughs> well, he, he was straight. Look, look at the village account. Both heavily using the market. Don't tell me both are going up to the castle. Castle age faster. 
Faster for Tato because oh. the castle he was in the queue. Now oh. I, 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 I. Well, I don't know. You but don't want to go. You don't want to go against Sicilians in a night rush. And remember one thing: if he's now massively mining his stone, and this is exactly what Tato is doing, the castle from Sicilians. I don't. I'm not sure, but they are very fast. You know, <laughs> you build very fast those. Yeah. You know what? Yeah. 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 Oh my God. Uh, Doubt reacting on the left hand side or on, on the top of his base uh, correctly. He sees that two villagers are there. And look at, man, look at what Dao, uh, Tato is doing. He's walling Doubt in. He's walling him in. And that's a great move. So Doubt really needs to make things happen here in the middle. Because if he's uh, stalemating on the middle or losing even in the middle, then he cannot uh, really have too much space on the outside as well to expand to. He has only one gold he can take before it's going to dry up. So, fortunately for him, Poles have cheaper uh, knights once they get the tech in Castle Age, in the castle. But that's a long way. He doesn't have any stone income right now. And the technology is very expensive as well. I think 500 food and 450 gold, something like that. Exactly. Yeah, but, you yeah. Don't have, but the, 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 the key is that there's no stone for him. Yeah. There's no stone. Honestly, for me, it's incredible. That Tato is still in this game. I mean, uh, he totally. shouldn't be in the game. Totally. Really. Yeah, I totally agree with that one. I thought he was completely dead as well at the beginning when he lost all his... Uh, or three villagers against the men in arms. But... Yeah, it was uh, very, very good by Tato to, uh, to do the crisis management. But still, look at that. 40 villagers against 50. That's insane, isn't it? Yeah, I mean... From where he got that difference because when we were checking we said oh two villages different when he was reading with those scouts what happened where he lost that many i i, I missed yeah. something but we see already one tc in the outside one tc right away we see also the dojo is gonna help a lot i don't know if ballistic will be lovely here because you you take those knights better with the dungeons but he has two dungeons at home so doubt won't be able to do a lot of damage with those dungeons there and he's going for monks so and the next one is gonna be a castle He's, he has 440 stone. If he's able to make a castle at home, Sicilian's boom, be careful with them. Yeah, that's that's definitely true. Uh, castle is definitely on the menu here for, uh, for Tato. And what is Tato doing? I feel like Tato... Man, look at how Tato is kind of playing this one. I feel like he's slowly but surely migrating everything to the outside because he knows that Doubt is fully committed into the middle and is also kind of uh, trapped there. And I don't think he will hold on the middle for too long because his biggest issue is that he cannot keep up with night production, with villager production, and he will just eventually be outrun by Doubt, who is just going for, uh, with a better economy, going for full knights, right? And the ram is also taking down the stable. Um, scout being cleaned up, and knights are being chased by Doubt, and um, yeah, I, I think Doubt is. Oh, does Doubt see it on the left hand side? The situation. Oh, man, Doubt sees it. No, no, he's he not. Didn't... He didn't see it. He converted. He converted one night. He's moving more villages there. He didn't react. And didn't react at all. The ram. If he's losing the ram, you don't want to lose the ram. That ram is gonna survive. Yeah. Still, it's a lot of farming for Doubt. Yeah. Doubt has nine villages more, sixteen army. Tato does have any army. I, I really surprised that he did the second TC. I think the play here was a castle at home. Uh, I was expecting a castle, just by the castle, you know? But mm. he didn't, and now what Tato is doing is just booming in the outside with three extra tone centers already. Yeah, yeah, that's his game plan, right? He wants to fully focus on the boom outside and hope that Doubt will be not fast enough to cut himself out of his uh, base. Because Doubt doesn't have gold in the inside, right? And that is a huge factor. Uh, he will be able to clean up a lot of villages though. How many more villages are there? Seven more villages, so... Seven. Uh, well... Yeah. So we'll... Ah, it's too many. Like, it's too I many villages so uh, well. still. I feel so as well. And yeah, Doubt is reacting properly to the ratings. No, he's, he didn't react there. But still, he will have 20 villages more compared to Tato. Uh, he has two TCs versus three. So Tato in theory should be able to uh, catch up eventually. But still, I don't think... Tato will have enough time, man. What do you think? Yeah, and not and not only that, it's like he has three TCs, but he doesn't have a lot of farm. Like some 
yeah, he bought it some food to be able to keep the, 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 the this is working. Now he's gonna take the monastery. He's doing another monastery. Like it, it depends a lot in, in how that is going to play. Now, obviously, the thing here is there's also a few knights ready now the farming <laughs> to, yeah. to doubt if he's still also losing villages and he's losing villages. Well, then he can't come back. <laughs> he's losing. Yeah, I so. mean, <laughs> yeah. Well, now he's killing houses. I don't know. One, two, three TCs. Well, the knights are going to be gone now. And as you said, he does have access to a lot part of the map. Yeah. But stone is crucial, and I don't see any stone access for Tato Tater. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think there's extra stone on this map. So you only have the eight gold uh, stone piles at the beginning. And that's all. Oh, yeah, there is. you're right. Yeah. So that's it's it? all. I think mm. so, right? So Doubt can take the the stone and from Tato, and that one should. How much is that? Three hundred fifty, one hundred eighty-two. Ah. Okay. I know for so a castle. We, yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. If he buys himself one hundred stone, then he yeah, should yeah. be enough. And <laughs> Doubt is kind of trapping himself <laughs> on the left hand side. Okay, he's getting out there. But th that's the thing, right? Fifty-one villages against seventy. I. Man, you might call me crazy, but I see a world where Tato still manages to come back into this one. Well, if if I don't call you crazy, I'm just checking the TCs. Two TCs for so long, the other has already four, and Doubt is doing now the third tone center, okay. Oh. Yeah, it can happen, obviously. Man. He's now not 20 anymore, he's 16 villains, so he's already catching up a little. He's taking relics, he's having a goal, he has 17 farmers, 20 farmers already, pretty much the same as Doubt. And the upgrades, the upgrades are better for Doubt. I mean, it shouldn't come back, but you know. Tato, you know, keep trying, man, try hard. Man, you know what I completely neglected? I completely neglected the fact that Doubt can go out on the left-hand side. And that gives him the possibility to expand on to the goals as well. So this makes Doubt's position so, so, so much better when I was initially uh, evaluating the situation. And he will be up to and Imperial Age pretty soon as well, I think. Exactly. I was about to tell you that, that he can go up to Imperial. Those four work cards use amazing, give you the food instantly. And... Uh... Well, uh, it's, it's looking very nice. Will is different, getting closer and closer. 12. Yeah. What is Tato going to do now? Is going to go army? Because Doubt is going imp. Going yeah. imperial. Yeah. I don't know if he really need to go up to imperial, but... Uh, yeah, I mean, he could go full army and still kill him. But obviously, if you go up to imperial, it's better. You can go chemistry, right? And uh, bomber cannons. Bombard cannons, Because yeah, I don't and, see a yeah. castle yet, for doubt. Yeah. Bombard so. cannons, exactly. Or you even go a different route and say that uh, you want to get onagers to cut the trees. But the oh, thing is, what, I, what, what kind of bothers me by doubt's position is the fact that he has not placed outposts over the map. You can place outposts so you get a vision uh, where the economy is of your opponent. Uh, Tato, he is completely neglecting Imperial Age. He wants to play fully focused on... On Castle Age and Doubt's economy is very much exposed by the looks of it. Yeah, it's what I wanted to tell you. He's going to Imperial, but now he has no real army there. All the army is on the left in the walls. Those walls that are going to survive because there's a mangonel, two mangonels yeah. now. The knights are yeah. plus one, plus one. Yeah. So, and look the amount of villains on goal now. Okay, now 12 because he has no goal right yeah. now. Yep. Where is the goal? Where is mining goal? I, I don't no see the goal for doubt. It must be on the south no. side, right? No, it's ah, okay. he's not mining. Yeah, it, it was just complete. Um, how do you say depleted? Right? He had that in the second TC, but yeah, it's yeah, gone yeah. now. It's gone now. Yeah. Okay. So this... he has zero goal. He's yeah. in imperial, but with zero goal. Yeah. Doing another TC, but oh, okay. I don't know, man. And Zilli is now tattooed with board, uh, Jordan. Yeah, yeah. He's uh, getting gold now. On the south side, on this 30C, in the north from the 30C. But, man, he's going for light calf while his opponent is going for knights. Yes, he's in privilege, but what does that really bring you if you don't have access to gold? And he's going onagers. He's going onagers, uh, man. Yeah, That's exactly he's going what onagers, I was but yeah. how much army he has? 17 knights. Well, he has a lot more knights than, than Tato. Yeah. Tato still have no army and no to stop that. 
But he's he's spamming now. He's doing more knights and more knights. Yep. The abris are important, very important. He's not taking the ramps. Oh, but look at Tatut. Tatut is smart. He's sending. He knows that it's the goal. He's sending the knights directly to the goal, ignoring everything. Doubt wow. do not notice. And yep. now the goal is gonna be my. He's going directly to the goal. Tatut is reading the game completely and really, really well. And now he's doing the pikes. He knows also that he won't have a lot of resources. I think. He know exactly what's happening. Eight villains, more population is very, very close. And be careful, killing a lot of villains there. Now 10 villains more for Tatot. Well, maybe it can happen. He's cutting now. He's cutting in that area, but he's fully wall. Even uh, with, the, yeah. with those, gate still open. Yeah. It's still open there, in my opinion. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It is, it is. Man, man, this is insane. After the first minutes, I was like, okay, Tato is completely out of this game. And he somehow managed uh, to get himself into a position where he's uh, still on equal terms, I would say. Okay, he's still behind, obviously, but he's somehow managed to salvage the position. And now let's see how well he can defend his uh, the ratings from Doubt. But it looks like Doubt's rating is very good, isn't it? Is it is definitely good, but those knights are not even plus two. What? It's against TC, he's spamming pikes, the knights he's yeah. in impedal, and those are still knights plus two. Why? Yeah. Because he has no resources, yeah. no food, yeah. no goal, he's still raiding. He should have got more pikes. I mean, uh, well, he's still trying to boom more and more. Tatot, that is uh, TC is obviously struggling. He has some knights there in the uh, on the stables, he's a spears from uh, from doubt. That is a good the, move. The, the timing advantage was so, so, so big. Yeah, exactly. He's losing army. Exactly. And now uh, Doubt manages to get himself 2,000 score ahead. Um, I like the pike transition. It's exactly the right transition he needs to do now. He was also getting hand caught now, which is the right move. Uh, gotta boost your economy there. Ram is going to get down. I think da Tata will be able to wall himself after this one again. And uh, ma'am. <laughs> economy wise it looks very equal uh, population wise 138 population against 130 and doubt still is lacking a bit of uh, pikeman here he still needs a bit more time to get that going he has no goal man he has no goal now more average yeah. now in the army in the army from from tato he's gonna have the plus two attack he has no army at all now tato with more army than now taking a lot and all the economy oh. now is exposed if he's taking this he's gonna kill all the villains and tato it is spamming military and taking absolutely everything the score difference is not 2000 anymore he's getting raided on the right at the bottom right corner uh, jordan is also raided uh, doubt but they still have a monk he is yeah. still doing barrack and now many villains are exposed and economy from doubt is weak, really weak, and no castles all over the map. No siege, no bombard cannons. So right now, even if he's in Imperial, he's castle he versus castle his army with Tato having triple the army. This is looking not so bad for Tato anymore. Also on the left hand side, he's doing a nice siege here with the two mangonels to kill Doubt's 30 C. And look at that map. His Doubt's economy, his main economy, is completely, completely exposed. And there are a lot of pikes and knights here from Tato to deal the do the job with the ratings. Uh, yes, Doubt is making a good move here in the south side. He was able to uh, cut himself out. He's building a castle now, which is a very nice move. He will be able to take control on the south side. But he, uh, then again, he will lose the third uh, TC eventually. And uh, man, this is a pike fight. Man, I need you to hype that uh, pike fight because <laughs> I find no, that one not so interesting. I can't, I can't hype. I can't <laughs> hype because there's no pike from doubt. It's, it's pikes versus nothing, you know, like... <laughs> that versus was, nothing. He's taking all the battles there. He, he's taking all the battles and now I see the castle there. Okay, he's trying to kill that owner with the pikes on the right. And here, Tatot has already taken an important lead. He might if Tatot is able to go up to Imperial yeah. at this point. Yep. It's gonna be very, very diff difficult, maybe, game from uh, from the Lord. But Doubt yep. has now the castles. Do not trap with it. Yep. That's what it can make the difference here. The traps can take pretty much everything. Well, you need army also to support. And he has no army. He doesn't have any all. army. He doesn't have any army. And Tato's... I, I don't know, like, Tato has 150 population against the 140 of, of Doubt. And uh, I feel like Doubt is not in the position yet where I would say, okay, he has... Uh, kind of gotten himself the power spike he needs from the Imperial right? He currently is fighting uh, pikes against pikes. What he wants to eventually get is Arbalest, I would say. Arbalest would literally counter everything uh, Tatu can throw at him right now. And uh, even, like, the pikes are not that efficient against the Sicilians, right? So, 
Uh, Doubt needs to find himself a bit more time, and he needs to be able to uh, get the. Oh, gold. the raid! Look at the raid on the right! Look at the yeah. knights! He's killing so many villages! So yeah. many villages to Doubt! He do not know he's killing a lot now. Coming with the pies, those knights still can deal with the pies if he play properly. Doubt, sorry, Tato, he need to go away. He's gonna raid uh, now the Lambriax. He's raiding a lot and he's recovering more and more map population. 162 for Tato. Doubt 154. He's taking the TC, but he has one mangonel and one trap. I'm telling you. If he's... Ooh, those mangonels are going to be down, but now sending more knights, he's going to take so many villages. If Tatot keeps sending villages here, uh, sorry, knights in the <laughs> south, he can kill a lot of villages to, 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 to doubt. <laughs> man, the, uh, man, I just absolutely love this, uh, love this game. This is insane, isn't it? There is a doubt castle... No, no, uh, doubt castle. Uh, a castle from doubt, that's what I was trying to say, in the if north side. And that one, if that if, one goes up. Exactly. If, because if Tatot see it, he has a lot more army there. Well, yeah. not that much anymore. Okay, he's spamming the pikes. Yeah. Okay, he did well. Can he we bought it the castle. <laughs> it's crazy, man. It's <laughs> but he's still raiding on the north. My yeah. goodness. Yeah. There is so much action on this map, man. I absolutely, I absolutely love this map. This is, uh, this is so great. I think you love because crazy. You love... Jordan, you love because you are watching. I would like to see your face if you are playing this. <laughs> yeah, if you are playing this game, you will be like, <laughs> you know, like, what is this, man? And what I do now? <laughs> who, who put this freaking map onto the map wall? Yeah, no, it's yeah, man. I, who is this? Remove it, man. Remove it. Okay. Yeah, I just love it, right? And now, now the big problem is right that uh, Doubt has gotten himself the castle, and that one is so crucial because it secures so much area uh, area for him and. The, the poles can go up with the Obuch, and the Obuch is such a nice unit to mix in as well. And I feel like Tato, slowly but surely, is running out of steam. He's losing more and more the ground, and his only option now is to kind of push himself out in the middle. But I don't really see myself or himself doing that. Man, what do you think? It's still taking all the gold miners. Look at in the north, in the south, sorry. He took another 15 villages on gold. Yeah. With the knights, he's raiding all the time. Now the Obuch and the Pikes are coming. This battle might be the game for one or the other. Who is going to take it? There's knights and Pikes. There's a lot of farming from both players. But kill advantage and Sicilian's knight eat the Pikes. This is a lot of farming. Look at the population. Tato is going with the ramps to the, take the castle. But those Obuch with the plus four are doing the job or not. It might be. He's trying to take the castle. He can. He's still taking the buildings. Tatito is still fighting like a warrior here with only 18 farmers need definitely more farmers he has 2000 wood now taking more buildings that was a mistake to send so many runs to that castle without the army he should yep. just kill the buildings uh, jordan yep. with the army he has he can just kill the buildings and doubt he's gonna make another castle yep. but he's unable to finish the game yeah exactly um you, you know the the fight for tato was so good right he just uh, completely dev devastated doubt's army there but the problem is as you already mentioned on the right hand side, he kind of sent naked uh, rams into the castle without any protection. So that one would not have been uh, too, too good, obviously. And now, Doubt is able to push back. And what else is going on? Doubt is, uh, Tato is trying to do some raids on the right hand side. But I don't think he's going to do, uh, you know, game damage. Uh, or like Now it's impossible. It's, it's I mean, just crazy, yeah. crazy, right? Now, now, now it's impossible because Doubt is just, uh, it's just buying the, those castles, he's just taking crucial spots, you know? Yeah. It's also with traps, he's cutting with donors, and now you need the farming. If it was 60 farmers for Tato and 20 on, on, on wood, just the opposite as like it is, okay, maybe, but like this, I don't see this is now being a comeback possible anymore. And yeah. even if it's a very nice game, Doubt hold this aggression yeah. and be credit to Doubt that he's taking most likely a 3-1 score lead, man. This is this is crazy. This is crazy. He has a 180 population against 130. Tato slowly but truly running out of steam here. What what else can he do really? He's doing some nice ratings on the right hand side, but I don't think it's going to be crucial. So doubt is uh, not having any economy anymore, right? On the south side, he's getting gold there, yes, but it's just it's just inevitable. It feels to me that he... Tato has to call it, and here we have it. Look, GG, 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 well, 3-1, yeah, the, the, crazy. Doubt taking a very convincing 3-1 lead, but I have to say, this is, this has been, the last two games, I absolutely love those. I felt like they had everything, and 
it was always so exciting. Of course, this game, at the beginning, it felt like, okay, Tato is dead, right? But Tato somehow managed to sneak out, make a good strategy, and we never really knew, Mamp, if Tato was completely out of the game or not, and he managed to give, make it very close, right? Yeah, he did it. But, he, but it's true that all the disadvantage came from one hole in the walls. I mean, yeah, all this yeah. snowball came from there. Probably yeah. against... 80% of the players in the in the DE community in the Age of Empires 2, he probably come back. But yeah. he's playing against Doubt that he was uh, raiding most of the time. And Doubt has a problem if you raid him very early. If you raid him when he has already set up his economy, he usually manages really, really okay, Jordan. I yeah. don't know what you think. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Doubt is just a beast in those kind of macro games, right? And uh, the longer the game goes, the more comfortable Doubt will feel. And uh, you could definitely tell at the beginning of once he reached Imp, he was a bit shaky, but then he got himself out onto the south. He was able to access the gold, uh, get the castle in the south as well, which uh, cemented his position on the map. And then once he got the castle up in his base in the north, uh, that was kind of the killing blow for Tata there.